Hey, McDowan here. Today we are taking a look at the 4-inch Fortnite Black Knight preset pack from Jazzwares. Just like a saved preset in-game, this set contains a figure, a harvesting tool, a back bling, a weapon wrap, and a glider. I got this from Amazon for $19.99. Anyway, let's take a look at the back side of the box. Up here, Black Knight, the odious scourge of Wailing Woods. And here along the bottom is the cross sale. We have now seen all of these action figures. For those who want to see the barcode, here it is. It is time to get this figure out of the box. If you are new to the channel, welcome, and please subscribe so you'll be notified of future videos. If you want to help the channel out and you play Fortnite, please feel free to add my creator code to your epic account. It's McDowan. Black Knight is a legendary skin, and he's part of the Fortnite set. Released in Chapter 1 Season 2, this skin was part of the Battle Pass at Tier 70. The glider is called the Scarlet Strike and is part of the Scarlet Dragon set and goes with the character Demi. He comes with the Axcalibur Harvesting Tool and we have definitely seen this harvesting tool before. The Black Shield Back Bling and again we have seen this before. There's the peg hooks on the back of the figure, quite nice. And an Assault Rifle with the Knighted Wrap. We have seen the weapon before but this is the first time we have received this red and black wrap. It's pretty cool looking. Looks like my gun has a little bit of a white speck or a smudge that's not supposed to be there. It's supposed to be a plain black, just like this side. It looks like a pretty cool weapon, though. And as I mentioned earlier, we get the Scarlet Strike Glider. This is a cool-looking glider. I do like the little designs on it. Seems like it can scratch pretty easy, if you can see that. Uh, it's a very typical glider design. It's the same one Jazzwares makes. It'd be pretty cool if they actually made some of the more unique ones, but I can understand probably why not, because the more times they make this and recolor it and put it in packaging, the more money they can generate off the tooling or the mold. And so I can understand why they wouldn't, but it'd still be really cool if we got some of the other unique gliders. This Black Knight action figure is about 4 inches tall and it has 28 points of articulation. Now, this figure has been released before exactly the same way. There's one of the versions right here from the Chapter 1 10-pack. And as you can see, it's got the same thing. The best that I could probably say is maybe there's a bit of a refresh in the paint. So maybe the red is not exactly the same. Maybe the silver is not exactly the same. There's probably a little bit differences. It's probably brighter or a little bit dimmer in, in places. But for the most part, it is not a different style. It is exactly the same. And because of that, that means the articulation is the same. I'm not going to go over it here with you, but the arms move. There's nothing uh, unique. I'll point out that the ruffle around his waist doesn't prevent him from doing the splits or sitting, really. It's just the mold uh, or the design of the figure that would prevent those items right there. So... I mean, Black Knight is pretty cool. So, yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get into that. So, I think we're gonna wrap this up because you've seen pretty much all the cool stuff there is to see at the moment. So, overall, I like the idea of the preset pack where you get all these different accessories. But I think Jazzwares missed the mark just a little bit on this one. It would have been cool, maybe if. Maybe it's a missed opportunity they could have released a character like Blue Squire. They could have used some of the same parts of, as Black Knight, molded a new head, maybe a new chest piece. I, I can't quite remember the differences. I don't know. I'd probably be pretty happy if they just put out a new head, and then they could have repainted it. The shield is the same for Blue Squire, diff and they could have included the same harvesting tool, and they could have included the same wrap even. And the same glider, just in Blue Squire style. So I think it's a missed opportunity there. Um, or they could have released another entirely different character where we got all their stuff. But for me, and everyone who buys a lot of this stuff, or gets it early on or the first time around, this is our third go-around with Black Knight. And so... To keep that line going, keep it fresh, you know, keeping new stuff out there while reusing what you can, I think is pretty cool. However, on the flip side, if you don't already have this action figure, this is a great set. Because you get the figure, you get all these things, you get a harvesting tool, a back bling, a weapon, and a glider. 
and it's pretty cool for you and that's great so anyway now it's your turn what do you think about this whole set the idea maybe the figure maybe the choice of figures leave your thoughts in the comment section below but before you go and if you haven't already check out my review of the gold eight ball preset pack in the lower left hand corner anyway thank you for watching please like this video and share it everywhere it really does help the channel i will see you in the next video